Hello everybody, it's Ziz here with another edition of the Stormfist Chronicles. We are on Ziz Stormfist, I'm now level 16. I've been splitting my points between Magicka and Health with a little bit more towards Health. Still using heavy armor for the most part, a little, little bit of light armor once in a while, and a two-handed weapon. Um, still using Critical Rush and Crystal Fragments, Velocious Curse, Major's Fury. I got Overload because I want to get my Storm Calling tree up as soon as possible. Also Lightning Splash for a little AoE. My second weapon set is very similar. I'm using a bow, um, but I don't hardly ever use it because it's more fun to just blow stuff up with a two-hander. Now, here I am. I'm in the second zone of Stormhaven up towards the north at a clear Alcair Castle. And uh, we're going to start this quest line. And here's a messenger. Gall and pox! Dame Davienne wanted me to tell the Duke you were coming here! You saved me back in Coglin Village. I'm the messenger, the one in the warehouse. And you, f you forgot to do your job? I'm sorry. I got back here and I had to tell my parents and my friends about the slaver attack down at the village. Oh. And then it just completely slipped my mind. Not much point in doing it now. Oh, so you're just standing by a fountain. Good job, bro. Idiot. I can't believe I forgot to announce you to the Duke. I really am sorry. I hope you can forgive me. No, I can't forgive you. Oh, yeah. I forgot to deliver the message to the constable in Coglin Village as well. Mm -hmm. That's actually kind of funny, isn't it? No. Unless... Are you frustrated with me? Yeah, you're a terrible I messenger. No, You're right. I've never been a very good messenger. I always wanted to be a king or a duke or something more important. But here I am. I'm doing my best. Please don't tell anyone about this. I'll do better next time, I promise. You can't even remember a message? You want to be a king? Oh, God. I hope I get to kill that guy later. He's really annoying. Hello. Let's see. Where to? We're gonna go... Where are we gonna go? I have no idea where to go now. I don't want to go over there. Hmm. Well, that's weird. It says I have a quest here. Let's go talk to this lady. King Faharajad has no authority here. She's angry. Damn foreigners. We've had nothing Ooh. but trouble ever since the Duke married King Faharajad's daughter. She's racist. And now they bring an army to our doorstep and expect the Knights of the Flame to just stand aside. What the heck is going on? Envoy Dorima marches up with an army claiming she's on a diplomatic mission from King Faharajad of Alakir. Mm -hmm. She says her message is for Duke Nathaniel alone and demands entry. All I have to say is over my dead body. Yeah, why can't she come in alone? That's what my I was thinking. My mission is clear. No one from the Red Guard camp allowed in the castle. I'm a Knight of the Flame, and I will enforce that directive to my dying breath. Sir Hughes is the head of our order. If you have concerns, speak to him inside the castle. Mm, all right, I'll go find him, crazy lady. She's grumpy. Let's go talk to this guy. Maybe he's a little bit more reasonable, I hope. There you go. All right. Ooh, bookshelf. The ruins of Kemsey. Uh, wardrobe. Got some water in the wardrobe. Let's see. You. You're welcome to Alcare Castle. I'm sure you noticed King Faharajad's army camped outside our walls. So you can understand why Duke Nathaniel is not entertaining guests. Hmm. I should hope you're not here to add to our troubles. I'm trying to help you, dude. <laughs> Don't hear that too often, but it's most welcome. If blood gets spilled here, it could destroy the fragile alliance holding together the Daggerfall Covenant. We need to defuse this situation as quickly as possible. Yeah, why don't you let him in? That would defuse Damn the problem. Dame Follett is holding the envoy up at the gate, isn't she? Never questioning orders is Follett's strength and her weakness. I'll have to send word to make an exception. Meantime, I actually have a task you'd be well suited for. Alright, what can I do? 
sensitive matter. Oh, okay. We've intercepted secret messages to King Farhar Jad from someone inside the castle who goes by the alias of Almandine. Almandine. My hope is that a little research in the library might reveal where this term comes from. You want me to go read books? All right, whatever. Unfortunately, the Duke requires that he personally approve all visitors to the library. And he can't know about this. The library guard, Sir Gregory. Perhaps you can persuade him to look the other way. Or, failing that, to leave his post. No problem. I'm a good persuader. Again, you must keep this quiet. I will. The Duke is already overwhelmed, and hearing about a spy inside the castle might push him over the edge. Get past Sir Gregory and into the library. Find out who Almondine is and report back to me personally. Yeah, no problem, bro. I gotcha. Nobody can resist the orc beard. You, out of the way. Hold it right there. Ooh. This is Duke Nathaniel's personal library. No access without his express permission. Mm, yeah, him and I are bros. Let me in. If it's an emergency, mm -hmm. you want the armory, not the library. It's just books in there. Honestly, I don't know why the Duke's so worried about it, but he is. If I let you in, I'd be kicked out of the castle. Probably my wife, too. Oh, jeez. So I can intimidate him by telling him I'm gonna beat up his wife? That's messed up. But we'll do it anyway. Hey, that's not very nice. My face is nice, though, isn't it? I don't like being threatened, though. Of course, it's not like anyone would know if you went in there. Yeah, exactly. All right, all right. You can go in, but don't say a word to anyone about this, or I'll lose my job. Remember, not a word. Yeah, no problem, bro. He has a terrible guard. I mean, imagine he's like guarding your bedroom at night. You know, you're the king and he just lets people right in. Terrible. Alright, let's find this book situation. Eh, that's not it. That's not it. Bookshelf. Ooh, it made my two hand weapon increase. That's why you always want to check the bookshelves. Look at provisioning. Mm. Boom, light armor increase. Look at all this stuff I'm learning. There's the book. Look at that one. The royal lineage of Sentinel. I found out who Almondine is. Good to go. Let's get out of here. Let's blow this joint. You, Sir Hughes. Sometimes a true knight must undertake a mission that requires reading books rather than slaying monsters. Such is what I asked of you. Did you learn anything in the library? I feared as much. We have to proceed carefully now. We don't want to alert the Duchess or King Faharajah to the fact that we know about the secret communications. Yeah. I hate to say it. I'm going to have to speak with the Duke about this. Mm. The fact that the Duchess is sending secret letters to her father is serious cause for concern. We need to know exactly what they're planning, though. Maybe she's just, you know, saying hi. You know, it's her dad, after all. After speaking with King Faharajad's envoy, Duchess Lakana asked to go out and negotiate with the Red Guard General herself. Clearly, we can't allow that. But the Duchess is refusing to let the envoy leave to deliver her message. Mm, I could do that. Exactly. Yeah. And in so doing, you would win her confidence. Mm -hmm. You already helped get the envoy through the gate, so Lakana will be inclined to trust you. Go speak with her upstairs. Do whatever you must to learn her plans. Oh, do whatever I must. Uh, I'm on that. No problem, bro. I can I can do whatever I must. No problem. Another bookshelf. Let's not pass that up. Hello, I'm here to do you, you whatever. Dorina told me you spoke to Sir Hughes about Dame Follett. Mm-hmm. Thank you. You're welcome. I don't know what a relief it is to have her here. I am an outsider in Alcare Castle, mm -hmm. with no one I can fully trust. You can trust me. Sometimes I even wonder if I can trust the Duke. Mm. Because there have been several attempts made on my life, all from someone within these walls. What? An Alakir poison intended for my lips killed one of my tasters just a few days ago. That's not good. There are many rivals for the throne in Alakir. They despise the Covenant, and they would kill me to destroy it. My father has been trying to identify the assassins. I must speak with General Thoda at the camp outside, but I am forbidden. Mm, I could be Can your I messenger. Trust you? Yeah. You did intercede on our behalf with Sir Hughes. Yeah, I did. Very well. But General Thoda will not expect you. 
You will need to get his attention. It may be difficult, but if you could best some of his warriors, he will want to see you. Oh, don't worry, I can do that. Thank you. Things are truly desperate when a daughter of King Faharajad must rely on the generosity of a stranger. But I do believe in you. The future of the Covenant and my life depends on you. Rupka, go with you, friend. All right, let's do this thing. Parkour! All right. I heard that Duke Sebastian was ill, but Gloria Fausta cured him. Let's go kick some, kick some butt, and make a name for ourselves. Talk to this dude, and then go do whatever's necessary to save the lady. You, sir. This is a military camp, not fit for the likes of you. Draw your blade. Nothing would please me more. Let's see how tough you are, scallywag. This other guy's helping. Oh, he just got shot in the face. One down. You should very well. We should. Boom, heavy attack in the face. Easy peasy, Japanese. Next, you look like you want to fight. These knights of the flame treat us like dogs. You gonna, think so? Let us I'm gonna dance kick there. your butt, mister. Let us dance. Boom. Let us easy peasy. Oh, let's help this person. They look like they need help. Well, Alright, one more. Who wants to taste the edge of my blade? You. Huh. Who is this little hip squeak walking hip through squeak. our cousin That's line? It. You're Let going down. Dance them. You're going down. Yeah, we're gonna dance it's on your face. Well fought. Boom. All right, let's go find this general. Cause I just kicked all of his people's butt. This army is not very good. Not at all. You, general. Hmm. Got some cool you armor, bro. Don't look so dangerous. Yet you waltz into my camp and pick fights with my soldiers. Tell me why I should not simply cut off your head where you stand. Mm, that's not part of the plan. The princess. She is all right then. That is good. King Faharajad sent me to protect her, but there is little I can do from out here. I do not wish to start a war, but I will if my king orders it. I await new orders even now. Do you even know who tried to poison her? Ah, yes indeed. The poison maker was quite stubborn, but he spoke a name with his dying who? breath. It means nothing to me, though. He said, Follett. Follett? She's she one of- is. Then she is in the castle. Oh, crap. Go then, quickly. Tell the Kama so that she may be prepared for this wench assassin. Wench assassin? I cannot go in, so you must protect her. No problem, bro. I'll do it. Stopping one wench assassin at a time. Giddy up, let's go, horsey. Oh man. I got the slow horse, not the fast horse. That's not good. <laughs> I don't know if I'm gonna get there in time now. Coming through on a slow horse to save somebody's life. Probably could have ran faster than that. Run, we gotta get back up to her bedchambers and warn her. Run! Alright, good. She's okay. <sighs> it is a relief to see you returned. I fear I might have asked too much. Tell me, though, did General Thoda have any new insights into the Yeah, he said Dame Falcon's the one trying to kill you. The Knights of the Flame are sworn to protect me. Why would one try to take my life? I know Dame Follett spoke out against my marriage to the Duke. I can't imagine how that could motivate her to mm -hmm. murder. Maybe she's got the hots for him. I hope Dame Follett was acting alone in this. If there is a wider conspiracy, I fear for what that might mean for our future. Uh, General Throda said you should get out of here, no, obviously. No, this will not do. What? To run would be to surrender to this madwoman's hatred. Or Follett be smart. Is the one who must pay. 
Though I don't always agree with him, Sir Hughes is a good man, and I trust him. Tell him of Follett's betrayal. He will see justice served. All right, stay here. I I'll go take care of this. I can't believe my suspicions were so far from the truth. The assassin being a Breton only makes this situation more volatile. Please, tell Sir Hughes and ask him to resolve this matter swiftly. Because it has greater potential for destroying the Daggerfall Covenant. Mm. My choice to go to my father for help rather than the Knights of the Flame only made matters worse. I'm sorry for that now. Yeah, should have known better. Indeed. But perhaps it would have been better if Sir Hughes had uncovered that truth. No time for regrets, though. We will do this properly now. Let Sir Hughes handle it. It is what's best for the Covenant. All right, let's do it. Where's Where's Huey at? Huey, come here, Huey. Where's he at? What's in here? Is this he? Here he is, Huey. What are you doing? I trust you've earned the Duchess' confidence by mm -hmm. now. That's good. Have you been able to learn why she was conspiring? Oh with her yeah. Father? Yeah, someone's trying to kill her. Angry. Attempt on her life that makes sense, but why go to her father? The Knights of the Flame are here to protect her. It makes no sense. Why would he send an army here? The assassin's poison came from Alakir. The Duchess mm. said so herself. Yeah, but it was one of your people who bought it, bro. Oh, Follett. Are you... Are you certain? Mm-hmm. That's a grave accusation. Of course she was opposed to the marriage. We'll have to question her, but sending a Knight of the Flame to apprehend her might not be wise. I, I can do it. Hoping you might volunteer. That would help... Avoid a scene. Follett's home is north of the inn. If you'll go there first, I'll get some of my men and come as backup. All right, I'm on it. Wait, before I do that, I want to read some books, though. All right, mead, mead, mead. Good song. All right, let's go get this traitorous wench. Right? Is that what the other guy called her? All right. Hello there. Over here. Dame Fahut, you're going down. I got my two-handed axe ready to cut your head off if you don't come peacefully. Oh, jeez. She is already fighting someone. She just ran me over. Oh, it's on now. Charge! Alright. Well, it looks like she was not going to come peacefully. So we had to kill her. Sorry. Where's Follett? Did she run? Why is he all out of breath? I'm sorry to hear that. You did what had to be done, and I suppose her reaction merely proves her guilt. I agree, Sir Hughes. I wish I could say there was no longer cause for concern. Somehow, though, I just don't think that's the case. Something about all this just isn't adding up. Mm, I agree. It's hard to believe Indeed. Follett was acting alone. I would very much like to discuss this with you further. But not inside the castle. My home is past the market. If you'll give me a moment to settle matters here and check on the Duchess, I'll meet you there and we can talk. I'll see you there. All right. Cow. Can you tip the cow? Ugh. Oh, she could tip the cow. Ugh. Ugh. They need to add that in as an option. I think if you're running you to the side of a cow, me, it should dip, it should tip them over. That would be awesome. Look at the castle. By chaos, by the void, and by cool. the darkness, may the doors of oblivion be flung wide. Who's that talking? Boom! Let's take a picture because that looks awesome for our photo Speak album. Softly. Last night's. All right, let's go tell this lady. I took care of business. I got the killer person. Wait, I think I went the wrong way. Whoopsie. Whoopsie, whoopsie. Alright. Whoop. Nothing here. Where are we going? Hail. We gotta meet him at his house. Where's his house? Oblivion yeah, come forth. The veil is pierced. Pass through the gate, I entreat thee. There we are. What's up, Mandel? How you doing? All right, let's talk to Huey. What? Who's this? Envoy Darima? You, 
Did Sir Hughes send you to kill me? What? You're not here to... Oh, no. merciful Stendar! Lakana! What? Sir Hughes is going to take it. What are you talking about? No, she's not safe. Hughes is going to kill her. He's crazy. Something about his dreams. If you don't believe me, check his journal. Huh? He's writing all about it. First, though, untie me. I have to get back to the castle and warn Lakana. Hold on. What the heck? His journal? What's, what's in his diary? All right, it's all clear to me now. The vision is a sign for me and me alone. I must do this myself. This is all for all clear. What the heck is going on with this guy? What is going on? Sir Hughes always looked a little grumpy, but now he's crazy? We better, we better hurry up and get there on our super slow horse. What? By chaos, by the what? void, What's this? and by the darkness, what the may the heck? doors of oblivion be flung wide. Oh, jeez. You see that giant sword in her back? That's clearly a bad sign. It's Sir Hughes's sword. What the? The Duke. What's she up, Duke? Not be dead. Well, yeah. not be real. She's dead. Uh, Lakana. See that you, giant sword? You spoke with her, didn't you? What do you know of this? Tell me. Um, Sir Hughes did it. Sir Hughes? Yeah. Was he mad? Mm -hmm. He was supposed to protect her. How will I explain this to Lakana's father? To his sister? Yeah, he's gonna be mad. Lakana would never hurt anyone. She was innocent. My beloved wife. Yeah, that's a bad day, bro. Sorry. I'll take this helmet, though. Thanks. I don't understand. Sir Hughes served me for so many years, loyally, faithfully. Why would he murder my wife? Uh, he was having some bad dreams, I guess, and he wrote it in his his dream journal. Dreams? Yeah. That maniac murdered my wife on the basis of a dream. Pretty he much. Won't die for this. You must help me find him. He's probably gone to Firebrand Keep. Please, do it for Lakana. Find Hughes and kill him. I can do that. Boom. Level 17. Oh, man. So there we are. The Duchess is dead. It's going to start a war. And we got to go over here to Firebrand Keep. And we need to kill that traitorous bastard. All right. I'm level 17 now. Let's put a little more points into health. And... That's it for this time on the Stormfrist Chronicles. I'll see you next time.